Yeah, when you get here, you're not just playing for your scholarship. You're not just playing for, you know, your friends and family at home. You're not just playing for the football team. Your teammates, you're playing for everybody in the stands who's watching you, who looks up to you. The little kid wearing, you know, a Cash Daniel 56 jersey or even an adult wearing a 56 jersey. It don't matter. No, yeah, well, (laughs) my point is that, you know, you got to realize, and I think we all do here, that, you represent more than yourself. You represent more than the people at home. You represent people that look up to you. So much more than a game. That's yeah, and that's and that's that's kind of what gets your juices rolling. You know, when you start step out on that field, you're like, okay, I'm here to represent people. I mean, there's two things at the start of a game that get me fired up, and one is being able to hear it's football time in the bluegrass. It's football time in the bluegrass. Uh, I mean, that just sends chills, chills all the way down my spine. Everybody just hear everybody the the rocked out. Oh, right I mean, there's I look forward nothing. to that every game. I love so I, I stand out. I stand out. Uh, I try to make the national anthem, you know, every time. And uh, I, I usually, if if I make it, I usually stand by Mitch Barnhart, you mm-hmm. know, or Coach Stoops, you know, or somebody like that. And and it was the game last year. I was standing there in the tunnel. And I was uh, I was listening to the national anthem, and the Jets flew over. And then the crowd is almost like the jet noise kind of canceled out the crowd noise mm-hmm. because the crowd noise was starting before as you heard the jets coming in. And as the jets flew over, it just went silent. All you heard was the jet noises. And then as soon as they cleared the the uh, the stadium, you just like eruption zone. Yeah, it's like, crazy. and I was like, it's football time.